With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Question is, figure shows a projectile thrown with speed 20 meter per second at an angle 30 degree with horizontal from top of a building 40 meter high horizontal range of the projectile is. Hence we can say here displacement along y direction is known as 40 meter and let's say y component of initial velocity is here our 20 sine of we can say here 30 degree sine 30 is 1 by 2 so this comes as 10 hence we can say displacement in y direction can be written as ut plus half at square this gives us the time of flight of the projectile hence displacement in y direction is minus 40 initial velocity of let's say y direction is 10 time of flight is t half of this comes as minus of 10 into this is t square so this comes as minus 40 is equal to we have 10 t minus of 5 t square so dividing by 5 this comes as t square minus 2 t minus of we can say here as 8 is equal to 0 so this factorizes to t square minus 4 t plus 2 t minus 8 equal to 0 so this comes as t minus 4 into we have here as t plus 2 equal to 0 so we can say time of flight of the projectile is 4 second now coming to the range of the projectile so displacement along x direction is the range which is equal to ut plus half a t square here we can say acceleration in x direction is 0 and time here is the time of flight which is 4 second. x component of initial velocity is our 20 we can say as cos 30 as cos 30 is root 3 by 2 so this comes as 10 root 3 hence the range is given as 10 root 3 into time here is 4 second and acceleration in x direction is 0 so the range comes here as 40 root 3 meter so we can say option number 2 is the correct answer hence 2 is our answer for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today